We're here with head women's basketball coach Carrie Jenkins for his weekly check-in right here on GoYo.com. Uh, coach, last week you guys went out to the left coast, came away with a couple of wins like Occidental and uh, Caltech, a couple of nice victories. So overall, why don't you tell everybody about the trip, you know, both on and off the court? Well, the trip was great. It was fantastic. I mean, I, I don't think that we could have asked for a better mid-season kind of bonding experience for the team. Um, we went out there and had an opportunity to play, you know, two good games, and one competitive, one not so competitive, but... Um, aside from the game themselves, I just think our, our, it was a chance for our players to get to know one another, to meet their families, uh, just for us to connect as a group. And I think we got a lot out of it. I think that we got to, got to see each other and get to know each other a little bit better off the floor. Um, Caltech was a it was a it was the kind of game you need sometimes. I mean, we were able to go out there and and uh, more or less play a scrimmage, more or less run through all our sets, more or less do everything we need to do. And I think it really helped us the next night because. Uh, we spent so much time executing the night before that we went out and played Occidental, and we did a really good job against them of, of running our sets and running our plays and just holding them and forcing them to play the game the way that we wanted to play. And we came out of there with two wins. I mean, I think that any time you take that kind of trip uh, and you come out with two Ws on a long trip like that, it has a long residual benefit for you as a team. So we're looking forward to moving forward from that. I think Cal we couldn't have asked for a more perfect, ex uh, perfectly executed uh, trip. It just went exactly the way we needed. Yeah, and then uh, back in action here last uh, night with a quick turnaround uh, against Bluffton. We're you know we're within five with about six seven minutes to go there, and then it looked like that jet lag kind of caught up to us a, a little bit down the stretch. Yeah, I think it was just emotional, uh, mental, physical fatigue just kind of all kicked in at once. We 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 do a really good job of fighting through adversity as a team. This team is pretty tough mentally, and I think we hung around kind of as long as we could have, and then we exhausted all of our kind of like. Uh, mental and physical focus, and it just kind of came, it just kind of fell apart on us at the very end. But in general, I was, uh, I recognized that that trip probably had some kind of effect on us playing yesterday, and I was happy with the kids' overall ability to just go out there and try their best to get through it. Um, I wasn't as happy with some of our uh, execution in that game, but overall, they, they gave a good effort. You know, we just got to kind of chalk that game up as kind of the link to the California trip and move on and get ready for Audubon tomorrow. Yeah, back action tomorrow against Otterbein and then uh, the conference opener on the weekend against Winberg. So, you know, let's focus on this conference opponent, this Winberg team, a, a team that we've played uh, very, very closely the last few years. We just haven't quite been able to get over the hump. So what do we got to do to make that happen this season? I mean, you know, we split the last couple of years. We'd like, to, we'd, we'd like to see a sweep at some point. I think right. that would be a, a big um, marker, benchmark for our team. And I think that we've done well. We match up well against Wit. They play the way that we play. We're about the same size. Um, this year, they've they've had some changes in personnel. They're a little bit more guard oriented than than they've ever been since I've been here. Um, so it's going to be a little bit of different game than we used to play against them. But you know, it's nice. I mean, that game in itself is one of three we have in the first semester, and we and it's a good chance for us to kind of make our mark here before this first semester ends. But Wittenberg's going to be a tough test. We always try to get our kids uh, kind of emotionally ready for them game, for those kind of games. Try to tell them it's a little bit different than out of conference, and when you hit conference, you got to be ready emotionally to play. So I think that's why these tests early have been good, just dealing with the jet lag on this game, having these back-to-backs, just kind of getting their minds focused and telling them, like, there's no excuses. I mean, we're going to go out, we're going to play, and kind of live and die with the results. Lance, Coach, good luck to you the rest of the week. Thanks, Mike. Appreciate it.